Today is uh, Tuesday, May 24th, 2016. This uh, two years old, right? Yeah. Dog hamster has a swelling. Uh, so we weigh first. It's about 40 grams, 40 grams, 39 grams, which is the uh, right, right size, right weight for the hamster. Okay, so they want to take up. So we show the tumor. Tumor is below the skin. Okay, come place it upside down. Not turn upside down. Okay. So you can see now has a has a has the hamster grows older, they develop tumors under the skin. In this case, this looks like a breast tumor because it's near the the breast area. The breast area is about one centimeter, one centimeter across. Now we will check whether it is affecting the armpits or not. If it's not affecting the armpits, let me turn again. If it's not affecting the armpits, then uh, it's easy to operate. But uh, the only condition is uh, very. Oh, let me hold, let me hold. Okay, relax. Uh, just hold like this. Uh. So, so we have a check first. Now I will hold it first. I may hold by the scruff of the neck. Oh, this under beat me with me. So we so Okay, so we first. Okay, yeah, first I feel. So anyway, okay, so this have this this uh, tumor is quite common. Now I have many cases that you can see from here. Normally it happens in old hamsters. And uh, what happened is in this case, this is below the abdomen, you can see here. It's also two years old. Huh? And uh, what happens if you don't remove it is that difficulty in walking in this case huh? because it's dragging on the floor. Okay, so so this is one case and this one of the examples. So normally before under anesthetic and then we cut off the tumor here. Huh? And normally they are fatty tumor, they look like fat and get under the skin. And uh, it's best to remove it when they're small. This one is quite big. Then uh, so we normally you shave the hair and then give anesthetic IM, Zolotil, and then give gas. Without Zolotil, it's, it's the, the, the results are not so uh, long, the anesthetic. So with Zolotil, then you, you just remove it. You see, it's a very big one, because the, the owner has a, has a delay. Now, we, after the stitch of the skin, we five zero absorbable sutures. And uh, this hamster was okay after that. The stitches are here and there. So similar with yours also. Only the thing is the danger is that it will come back again because it is cancerous. If it's not cancerous, then uh, then uh, it will be okay. Then the other thing is the anesthetic risk because it is two years old. So although we have 99%, they don't die under anesthetic. But we cannot say that about 100%. You come in only that. Uh, it won't die, see. but I have confidence that uh, if the hamster is eating and active, like that is this one, then uh, chances of you dying on the anesthetic is like zero in, in, in our experience with the operation of about maybe 50 to 100 tumors over the years. Uh. But the smaller, of course, the better. This one is not small really. Small means uh, about uh, 3 millimeter. But that's kind of you know, right? Yeah. Most likely a breast tumor, yeah. And uh, so if you are willing to take the risk, the anesthetic risk of dying on a brain table, then, uh, then, then we can remove it. Mm -hmm. uh, because uh, we have to inform the owner of the anesthetic risk. Huh? Yeah. Then the, the hand is okay with it? Yes. Then there was a pour water. Yeah. Pour water. Come see. On the which foot is it? In the left four, left, left four, yeah, there was a what up here. Lucky it bite me not painful, the left. We can see uh, we can see the left four. Is that in zoom in the left four? Left four on the table here. Yeah. This hamster is actually quite nice. Yeah. The wall is still there? No more? I think a small one. This one is very hard to operate but it's, it's, it's looks like gone. Yeah. That's how it's much bigger, yeah. Yes, that's why this now this hamster, you notice, it's been biting his uh, toes, right? I it's been biting his toes because his hair is all gone. Compared to the back feet, you see? 
see the back feet, he got a lot of hair. Yeah. Well, why is he biting the toes? He's biting pre-home. Oh, so these are the examination before operation is active. So it's a it's possible to operate. So it's a subcutaneous tumor, most of the breast tumor in a dwarf hamster, two years old, male or female? Female. Female, and uh, it's very, uh, very common, very common in uh, Singapore dwarf hamsters. I, I, I guess all over the world, it probably is quite common when they're over. So the best is to remove it before they become uh, too big and then it's very hard to, to remove because some of them spread to the elbow and uh, some of them spread to the armpits uh, then it's hard to remove because there's no skin to stitch up. Okay, thanks.